The first step in generating a new Manual Guide I program is to create and name the program. This provides a container in which to store the program commands and identifies and distinguishes it from other part programs, so it can be called up and executed at a future time. To create a new part program, the CNC must be in edit mode. Machine tool builders use either a collection of push buttons or a rotary selector switch to allow the operator to select the CNC mode. Refer to the machine operator manual that came with your machine to determine how to select edit mode on your particular machine. With NC Guide, edit mode is to be selected using the mini operator panel at the bottom left of the screen. Begin by selecting edit mode. You can confirm that the CNC's in edit mode by looking at the mode status display in the top right of the manual guide all in one screen. Note that when edit mode is selected, the soft keys at the bottom of the screen change to include new selections, including the new program soft key. To create a new manual guide I program, press the new program soft key. The create new program or folder dialog box is displayed. You have the choice of entering a traditional FANUC O number or an alphanumeric name up to 32 characters long. The FANUC Series 0i Model F is the first FANUC Series 0 CNC to support the 32 character display name that is now popular with the latest FANUC Series 30 CNC. Of course, the traditional O number is backwards compatible with decades of FANUC CNCs, whereas the 32 character program names are more likely to be used in shops with a large number of newer machines. To create a program using the traditional O number, enter the letter O followed by a four digit number. Next, press the Create soft key. Now the program created begins with the O number followed by a semicolon. The semicolon is a symbol for end of block. This just separates individual CNC blocks or commands. The program ends with the percent symbol, which is the end of file marker for the program. To create a program using the 32 character name, press the New Program soft key to display the Create New Program or Folder dialog box. Program names can only contain the alphanumeric characters 0 through 9 and A through Z and a few special characters, including the dash or minus sign, the plus sign, and the underscore character. No spaces are allowed in program names. For this example, let's use the program name MGI-Example-01. Again, we press the Create Soft key to finish the program creation. When the program name is created, it's automatically surrounded by angle brackets, that is, the less than and greater than symbols. That is all that's required to identify the part program. However, it is possible to add additional comments that will appear in the program list or directory alongside the program number or program name. To display the program list, press the O list soft key. Note that the MGI example 01 line is highlighted, indicating that it is the active part program. There are four fields in the program list for each program. The first column is the program name or number. The second column is a comment, which is currently blank for the new program. The third column records the date the program was last modified. The fourth and final column records the size of the part program in number of characters. With carefully selected 32 character program names, it's pretty easy to identify part program. Some will use drawing or part numbers in the program name. Program numbers are a little less unique since they are limited to four digits. However, program comments can be long and include a wider range of special characters 
than either the program name or program number. This makes them very helpful in identifying park programs. Note that program comments over 19 characters long are truncated in the program list display, but are fully visible in the actual park program. To add a comment, press the Edit Comment soft key. Enter the comments. In this example, we will use the comment to track the revision level. We enter revision space one. To save the modified comment, press the Alter soft key. To return to editing the part program, press the Close soft key. That means we are closing the program list window and returning to the all-in-one screen and its soft keys. Note that the program comment follows the program name and is enclosed in parentheses. This concludes this tutorial on creating a new Manual Guide I program. In the next tutorial, we will insert a section of code at the start of the program that establishes known initial conditions each time the program is executed from the beginning. Thank you for watching.